It's time for the MCTS Experience with Mr. Orr and Mr. Nash. Discover your passion and unlock your future. I say this, Mr. Nash, with all oomph and enthusiasm and everything you can put behind it. Welcome back. Yes! Tasting victory, as I love to say. <laughs> we are we are making it happen, Orf. We're back. We are back, baby. We're going to have an outstanding year. I cannot wait. The 2021-2022 school year is primed and ready to go and much, much needed. I can tell you, it doesn't matter whether we've talked to students, we've talked to parents, we're talking to fellow teachers, staff, administration. Everybody's pumped to be back on campus. We're making it work. We're figuring it out. It's it's a, a moving target that we can hit bullseyes all day long because that's what MCTS does. And we kill it. Can't wait to get the students back in here. Dave, we're doing this wrong. Mr. Nash. Hit me. We forgot our procedures. Uh, listen, it's new. We're coming off the bench. We're a little rusty. Knock shaking, the rust. off, shaking off the rust. Knock the rust off. It's still there. I've got gotta- my oil can out. Welcome, everybody, to the MCTS Experience our first episode of the 2021-2022 school year. Um, with me, as always, is my partner in crime, Mr. David Nash. I, we're, we're so excited th- that we, we flew off the bench, and I love it because it's real. It's transparent. Yeah. It's genuine. The excitement and the enthusiasm just superseded protocol, Orf, and I'm okay with that. Coach put us in. We wind sprinted onto Dude. the court. 100%. Second of all, uh, and, and oh we would gosh. be highly remiss if we didn't We say, wouldn't be doing it. We wouldn't be doing it. The glue that holds <laughs> the whole thing together. Nick MacGyver Sikowski with a microphone nearby? No. No just mic head not. Head not. <laughs> as, but now things are starting. To, the, the binoculars are coming in focus. As always, <laughs> producer Nick will not have a microphone. That's it for the rest that, of the that's year. A, that's all you get, everybody. Silent but effective. Just give me a hit. Eh. No, we might get him in here. You Let's never get know. him in. I mean, I could just lean over. Uh, no, know, don't no, no. listen. He's got to grab that mic and get really passionate, and we'll get that. We'll solicit that somehow. That's actually a nice segue. That's something for you guys to look forward to in the coming year. Mm-hmm. We're gonna make make MacGyver talk a little bit. Um, but other things, other things to look forward to this year on the MCTS experience. Nash, take it away. Well, other than the fact that we're getting everybody back into the programs that they love, it doesn't matter whether you're in, in a, a white collar program, a blue collar program, an entrepreneurial program, a health science program, a STEM program. It doesn't matter. Hospitality. Our staff is here. Students are excited to be here. If you're listening to this before school starts, always know the first three days are like a warm up. We know that districts start differently. All the teachers and staff, we, we often hear students calling or parents calling. Uh, wondering, hey, are you guys hit the ground running? Well, of course, we're going to do functional things and we're going to move the ball down the field. But the rubber really doesn't start hitting the road till that Monday. So if we start on a Wednesday, you really start uh, taking on excitement and moving the, the the progression of a learning and understanding with with the genuine component by Monday. So let's pretend your district starts on Thursday, but we start on Wednesday. Of course, try to be here. Yeah. But you're not going to it's not like you're going to be overwhelmed and miss tons of content. So that's something that I I remember as a student here. And then I remember when I was in a classroom and I still remember and it's 21 years now for me in the game. So sharing that. And just to clarify, uh, I don't want to confuse our listeners. First day of school for us, Mm -hmm. September 7th. It's a Tuesday day after Labor Day. All right. Great. Write that down, folks. Put it in ink. And as as Mr. Nash said, uh, your district might be starting on the 8th. We are open for business. So get in here if you can. Yeah, if it's possible to get here, get here. Because And then when you get here, it's very welcoming. There's tons of staff that guide you where to go. Yeah. It's not like you get dropped off and you're in Antarctica and and you don't. And, and students feel that way. I felt that way. And then very quickly, the MCTS family embraces these guys and girls that come off these buses. These parents drop off. Uh, maybe they ride their bike here. We have kids ride their bike here. It's very much a reality. But the, the key component is we got you covered. We know how to do it. We've been doing it 50 plus years. And we treat every year as if it's a unique experience for every individual coming here. That's right. If you haven't heard from your home district's transportation department, Mm -hmm. uh, get in touch with them. If you don't know how you're getting here, uh, get in touch with your homeschool district. Yeah, give uh, a call. To find out about transportation. Um, That first week, week and a half, two weeks, everybody and their mother is going to be outside waiting for the buses to arrive. We're going to point you in the right direction. Like Nash just said, Mm -hmm. welcoming. We're making you feel welcome. Uh, Cause we're glad you're here. We can't yeah, wait. And, and, and you don't have to bring your uniform on the first day. If you've heard your program requires a uniform, Mr. Nash, I didn't know what you even now. All that'll come out in those first couple of days. We got you covered. Fear not. All you need to do is be here. We got you covered. Yeah. But you just arrive. We'll take care of the rest. It's absolutely right? true. Absolutely true. A um, couple of quick announcements. Uh, we are going to be offering vaccination clinics for students and parents and families. Uh, the first uh, inside the first month of school, please continue to check our website. Sure. Check your emails. 
Check your emails all the time, people. Students, this is it. We're we're moving into adulthood. Check your emails. Listen, that's how we communicate. Of course, of course, you're coming off Teenage Island. You're going to hear a lot about Teenage Island and how to build your life or have to get off of it. That's one of my favorite analogies. <laughs> and, and we do that here. The, I mean, MCTS is a career in technical schools. We teach a career, not a job. And job stands for just over broke. Career is lifelong, fulfilling uh, ways that you can leave your parents' house, have your own car, have your own money, build your own vacation. That's really, we teach guys and girls that. That's the reality of adulthood. Adulthood isn't to be feared. It's to be embraced because you are unique. You have gifts. You have abilities that the marketplace wants. And we're in a labor drought in this country. I, exciting news all summer long. I've checked, like Mr. Orr says, checking my email. I talked to literally 50 plus employers all over the range of what the programs. That That's what offer. you do. It's what I do. I'm the, I'm the internship coordinator. I'm the career counselor. But in addition, like in the summer, I was fielding tons of phone calls, emails, uh, plugging people in. We got opportunities. Um, if you so, if you're a, a first year freshman, we're going to teach you how to obtain your first entry level job. If you're a junior or senior, we're going to teach you how to get an internship in your career. Notice the difference. Jobs are first. Career internships are second. By the time you graduate, you're going to definitely have a time to either plug into your career area study, continue to post secondary education, whether that be trade school, college, military, whatever you're looking for. That's what we do here at MCTS. Every one of these career pathways that we talk about are just that. It's a pathway and it's got a lot of different oh directions you can go. If you choose, you know, one of our programs, you're not stuck in that. No, not, that that's not the only route. Every it looks like a little tree branch. There's it does. All these little offshoots it, it, coming. I, I love a them. A lot of different directions you can take. It's like, in other words, graphic arts. If if you go to graphic arts back in the seventies, it was like you were pouring ink on a printer, and that's all you did. And that's it. That's it. Yeah. That, if you were a mechanic, if you went to auto mechanics, that's all you did. Yeah, you were a mechanic. My God, there's so many career oh, possibilities with both of those. Areas. It's endless. Yeah. It's endless. Those are just two real quick uh, elements. Look at our criminalistics. I mean, you want to talk about. Uh, oh, my uh, heavens. Forget I, it. I can't, I can't even begin to put into words. Anyway, so if you're sitting here having maybe having younger siblings or you're thinking about somebody's coming and, or it's your first time, and you're like, well, I don't know if I want to do this or not. It's OK. We're going to teach you how to be understanding of the career and the nuts and bolts to figure it out. And we'll get you going in the right direction. That's what we do here. And we do it well. That's right. Um, Speaking of that, we have we continue. I'm I have been hammered all summer with more applications, really more people trying to get into these programs. So just keep going to our website. Keep going to the website. There are two application portals open now. One for the current school year. So I can apply now. You come. could apply now for this year. Still twenty one, twenty two. Many most of the programs are full. There are a couple of spots open. Check it out. We'll get in touch with you. Just go apply if you still haven't figured it so out. So you'll see it, Orf. If I applied online and my son or daughter, you know, we weren't sure how the summer was going to go, what was going on with the school year situation. Holy cow, I want to do this. I can apply now. You still can. Believe it or not, you still can. I love it. But um, if if one of the programs you apply to is full, I'm going to call you. I'm going to call you myself We're still and talk say, to you. sorry, but what about this and this? And I'll, I'll steer you in the right direction based on your interests. I love it. All right. Um, speaking of that career, uh, newcomer Academy, very quickly, if you know someone who's uh, new to our country, a high school age student who has just gotten here, um, we are opening, uh, this year, beginning in September, a newcomer Academy. This is for high school age students. Very exciting. ELL students, um, pass it along. Send What's ELL website. stand for? Tell the people. English language learner. Love it. All right. Um, so, uh, point them our way. It's a very, very small group. We're only taking a few students for this but there are still a couple of spots. So if you know someone who fits that description, have them apply, have them check out How the cool website. How cool is that? All the information is up there. And last but not least, if you know a recent Trenton High School graduate, there's a very special program for them. That means someone who graduated in 2021 or 2020. Um, check that out on our website too. Information. Go to the website it. for the First Timer Academy or Trenton 2020 graduates, 2021 graduates. That's exactly right. Um, on that note, uh, what do you think, Nash? Any 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 beacons that you're looking forward to? What's on the horizon for you personally and for MCTS as a family? Well, I mean, other than the fact that people are just excited to be back in person, that just goes without saying. I, I'm I'm excited to hear that there's an uptick. There's a passion, even amidst what we all went through for the past, you know, 18 months, two years, whatever you want to call it. We're still moving through it. But the fact that our our application numbers are up, interest in our programs, it, it just proves that what MCTS is doing is the meat on the bone about guys and girls and what they want to learn in terms of their career. It's something in school that they're like, hey, I understand I have to do the English and I have to do the math and I got to do my sciences, but I'm really interested in this. And that's the program that they chose. 
And that program's taught by a person that is still doing it or had done it very recently. And, and they're super connected in the industry. I mean, to me, it's just so neat to see people still passionate. And it used to be like 20 years ago, 25 years ago, they were like, oh, I don't know about this place. I see a massive uptick in people wanting to be here because they want this real education. Yeah. They want to invest their time in something that they can be passionate about. And that's what we are. Parents, students, uh, recent graduates are all also starting to see, oh, wow, you know what? This whole time when businesses were closing and people were having a hard time, guess what? Our people were out there working. And, and not working, making big rocks into little rocks. <laughs> they, they, they were using really technical skills, interpersonal skills, skills in the hospitality industry, and, and, and doing phenomenally well fiscally. But more importantly, they loved what they did. Yeah, they, not just surviving, key. thriving. Yeah. You just 100%. gave me a great idea for a new program, making big rocks into little rocks. Quarry, shared time quarry program. Listen, the Flintstones. I, I love listen, it. We're gonna. I'll crack go. These listen, rocks. I'll go to the end of I'll get the entrance of the school and rub gra <laughs> grab some gravel off the ground and rub gravel in my hair. What do you think? It'll be a win win win. I cannot wait. I'm busting at the seams. I know that MacGyver is too, even though you can't hear him. Um, Nash, he's gushing. He's it, gushing with enthusiasm. It is going to be a fantastic year, and we can't wait for it to start. We're busting at the seams, and we can't wait to see all of you back here on our campuses. Um, this is Mr. Orf reminding you to like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest, um, Google Play, Spotify. You can listen to this podcast and share it along with uh, the Principal's Office podcast, a new version with our uh, two new principals on Google Play, Spotify, iTunes, of course, our YouTube channels. We have so many fun videos. A brand new one that's going to premiere very, very soon. It's going to drop. You're dropping a video, Orf? We're dropping it. Uh, a YouTube video, um, and, and we want you to share it and like it with a with a welcoming back message for all of our students and families. Uh, we can't wait to first see timers, it back. first timers, the whole the whole nine yards. Everybody's gonna how everybody's can you go wrong? Love it. How can you go wrong? Um, so until then, uh, please uh, share this podcast with a friend and uh, tell all your friends about us. Check out our website mcts.edu. And until we see you on that first day of school, this is Mr. Orf along with my partner in crime, Mr. Nash. And on behalf of Nick MacGyver-Sikowski, reminding you to discover your passion. And unlock your future!